What's up guys, Pavlo Gaming here, and today, um, I have started another series, great, uh, I think you're all saying in your heads, um, this is going to be a play series, I wonder where I got that idea from, <coughs> Nerd Cubed, <coughs> what, who said that, um, anyway, um, I actually did like, I do like the idea of a play series, hence why I'm doing it right now. So this is just a series for all you people that don't know that um, I basically play games that I like or have no idea what, uh, well, that's the new play series, Mark, well done. Um, I just play games randomly, so uh, the Uncharted games, this game, uh, which we'll find out about in a minute, um, play uh, big release games, small release games, indie games, all that. Uh, stuff right there, so that's what the play series is going to be about, and all those tanks just got obliterated. So, uh, this is Tropico 5, uh, the fifth one, there's a lot of them. Um, this is basically a city builder, excuse me for that uh, interruptment. Um, this is a city builder, but it's like slightly different than all the other city, builder, city builders uh, out there. So, um, let's get right into it. I will load up a already made city that I've been working on for like the past few days and I'll get right back to you. Okay guys, so um, you can see all my cargo ships here uh, coming in and out and there's a thing up in the top left telling me what uh, goods have came in and how much they're worth and the people coming into my city. So uh, are you ready to see my city? It's terrible looking but uh, let's, get, let's see what it looks like. I, you can't see it because it's top down. There it is. This is my city so far. This is like, I maybe 12 hours in. This is what I've built because I had to like redo the city and all out there because uh, there weren't enough houses and all out there. So this is what the city looks like. Uh, this really isn't the best weather to show you in because usually it's like bright and sunny and sun's out and everyone's topless and yay. But no, it's decided to rain and be dull for this video. So this is the aircraft carrier, uh, you can build one of these, which is sad because these things are overpowered. So basically these two jets here, when you're getting attacked, because you get attacked quite a lot in this, and when you're getting attacked, these things fly off and they like drop bombs on whoever's attacking your city. And there's also a, hold on, there's also a thing that says fire at will. If you turn this on, they will fire at the enemies no matter where they are. See, I have it off right now, so if the enemies attack me, they can only attack the enemy where there are no buildings and civilians in the way. If I turn that on, they will bomb them at wherever they are. They could be in the middle of this housing estate. They won't care. They'll bomb them. There's a hand glider there. Um, this is just a lighthouse because I found it in the one of the menus and just decided to build one. I have infinite money and I have infinite time ruling right now, so I don't really care. Um, these are all my docks. As you can see, I have quite a lot of them. Uh, they bring in shipments for all the manufacturing factories that make cigars and cars and electronics and all that stuff. They bring in the materials for them. Um, I've split the city up into districts, like a really big city. So um, this is like the residential, well not that part, but this is the residential district, like this part and then all the way down like to this very, to this dock. This is all like the residential district that has all the housing, it has... Uh, these like uh, per houses, it has uh, like the normal houses, it has mansions, has like uh, sort of flats, um, it has my house, well palace, uh, it has this stuff because you can't actually move this stuff, like the uh, the teamsters office and all that, you can't actually move them, so I just have to leave them there. Um, that isn't, that's a library I think. Uh, all the houses then these are the big modern apartments that you have to like uh, research to get uh, so these are the big modern apartments I like these I've scattered these around the city a wee bit just to make it look more city like uh, then just another big bulk of normal houses so um, that's the residential district uh, this is like the um, let's say the farming well it's like a very small district it's like literally this right here uh, this is like the farming district, so this is like, um, all of these are like, uh, high-tech food growing facilities, and then this is like a, fa or a factory farm, I think it's called. Um, th that's just like, 
a big massive farm like as you go up in the years as you can see down in the bottom left there I'm in November of 2023 when I started this off I was in the 1980s uh, so like it went from just an old school farm to this like a big massive farm and these went from like uh like big massive growing fields to the big massive high tech things they just like upgrade themselves as you go through the years uh, this is well not that I keep on going on to the wrong things this is the very small uh, education district with a couple apartment buildings um, as you can see here this is a library yes it is this is a library this is a college uh, this is a high school between two massive apartment buildings because I had no other place to put them uh, this is another library because library get your research gets your research points and this is an observatory uh, so that is oh a great to try and tropical spiders president this is just talking to you about like uh, there might be a rebel attack soon um, this is the industrial district uh, this part right here so um, you have well, it's just a consulate. Uh, this thing this is the Russian consulate. Yes, it is. Um, I just have no other place to put it. Uh, this is a power plant. A uh, big, massive uh, power plant. This is an elect electrics factory. This is a fashion factory that makes clothing and all there. Great. Great. Thanks for telling me. Um, this is a cigar factory. That is an oil well because there's an oil reserve like spurting out over here so uh, now I'm making oil here. Um, this is a car factory and that's a pharmaceuticals place makes like a uh, medicine. And then these are all the things that are powering my massive city. Uh, I think there's five of them. Five of these and then there's also a water treatment facility which I'm going to have to build another one of soon because there's not uh, enough sewage coming through yet. Uh, it is a game that you're going to have to think about. Oh, people have built sh shacks. Um, that's what people do in this game. If you don't have enough houses built, I'm going to have to build some more. If you don't have enough houses built in uh, the game, uh, you people will start building these really terrible looking shacks. That will make your city look bad. I think that's the reason they build them like that, so you would make them houses. So, um, as you can see here, I'm going to expand this the more, like, uh, because the more I expand this, the more electricity the city's going to need, so the more I'm going to have to build these. Uh, so I just made it a wee bit bigger. This is, uh, it's, uh, how would you say, like, the, sort of, the, I don't even know what this is. This is just a uh, random assortment of buildings I didn't want to put anywhere else. So we'll start from this. And this is the Chinese consulate. Uh, no, it's a mansion. Uh, no, it's the USA uh, consulate, so that's just another one I am. That is a customs office. This is a police station. Um, this is a hospital. This is a church. No, a Catholic mission. It's like a sort of, I, I don't even know. This is a church. This is the Chinese, oh, the Middle East. Where's the Chinese one then? I, don't, I can't even remember where I put that. Um, this is a bank. No, it's an opera house. This is a c cathedral. Oh, that apparently someone's decided to sing over me. A uh, supermarket because there was no other place to put it. People have built shacks behind here again. God damn it. Uh, this is a grocery store, like a really small one next to a supermarket. This is a inn, like an old school inn. And then, I can't remember what this is. A clinic. It's like a sort of doctor's office. Oh, here. No, that's the Russian. Where do I? I don't even know. And uh, finally, yes, this is the final thing. This is the entertainment district. Uh, as you can see, it's not finished yet. I haven't really finished building everything yet. But um, cinema, or cineplex, it's called. This is a nightclub. This is like a sort of cabaret, or I don't even know how you pronounce that. I'll get onto the skyscrapers. Uh, this is a... I can't remember what this is. What is this? Oh, it's a casino. Ah, alright, okay. Uh, this is a casino. This is a hang gliding club. As you uh, like, as you could tell when I was floating over everything, there was like hang gliders going about. Uh, this is a stadium. Uh, plays football. Uh, as you you might be able to do that. Uh, you won't probably. Uh, there's like cheering in there. Um, uh, oh, and there's a, a restaurant down here, and then there's like a no. That's the restaurant. That's the like tavern. It's like a really small hotel. And then, now we get on to the skyscrapers. This is another fashion thing because it looked nice. Circus. 
uh, this is a park, the way the parks work is you just join it up and then like you put it in a place with lots of trees and then it'll uh, more people will go to it the more beautiful beautiful it is like with the more trees and more rocks and all there uh, so that's a park uh, they these are apartment buildings that I had no other place to put this is a spa like a big massive spa uh, this is a TV station uh, like a broadcast station and this is an office like a big massive office um, I don't think that's everything yeah I've explained all the docks Oh, I didn't mention I have a cruise ship over here. Uh, that's just a basic thing. People go here if they want to relax. Uh, they are floating at the moment. They must be all Jedi's. Um, and this is a dry dock. The dry dock doesn't actually do anything. It doesn't like build ships or anything. It uh, speeds up the the speed of these because these things you see the way they're moving sort of normal normal speed. Um, well, back before I got got that. Um, these things were really, really slow coming in, so it in it increases the speed of these things, which is quite handy. So, uh, oh, it isn't done yet. I haven't mentioned the coolest part of this. Uh, you may have noticed when I was talking about the education district earlier, I have all of these. Uh, these are military bases. Um, as you can see, there's quite a lot of them. So, um, how many do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... Uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 12, yeah it's 12, no 13, 14, uh, 14 military bases in total. All of these have 5 tanks, like every single military base has 5 tanks in them, so I don't even want to do the math on that, that's like, hold on, 60, that's 70 tanks in total. And then I also have these, these are uh, barracks, these have squads of soldiers in them. As you can see, they're marching up and down here. Um, yeah, so let's just say here. Oh, and this is a fort. Uh, this is a fort um, for like uh, these have uh, special units in it. This, these are like special units. They run faster and kill people faster. Uh, I can't remember what this is. Oh, it's a space program. Yes, that's a space program. It fires a rocket up. Um, it fires a rocket up like every ten minutes or something. I wonder if we'll find that or see it in the video. And then this uh, puts the, the cherry on top. This is a nuclear program. This fire, I think it's about the fire. Is it about the fire? Uh, anyway, I don't think it is. But uh, oh, oh no! It just it just fire. We missed it. Um, this is a nuclear program. So eventually, your your because the big the bigger your city gets, the more uh, countries want to evade you. Invade you, sorry. Uh, so this, if a country uh, starts trying to invade you, this thing will fire nukes up and like uh, blow up their country. Like it fires up nukes, but it, like I think they're test fires. They don't actually hit any countries. Um, so after explaining, oh, and this is a science center. It like uh, gives you more research points. Uh, I think that's everything. Yeah, I think that's everything. So um, since the since uh, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna make these videos 20 minutes long, or maybe 15. I don't know. Uh, since we have some time left, I'm gonna start building some things and show you how the game works. So uh, back to you in a moment. So guys, as you can see here, this is like the building menu. You have lots and lots of um, sections where you can build stuff. So this is like the uh, sort of just the normal thing. You can build roads, demolish buildings. Build uh, metro stations all out there. I have some of them dotted around the map, but I couldn't find them. Um, this is like uh, farming stuff. So that's that's what the uh, big high tech farms looked like at the start. It was just those with a bunch of fields around them, and that is what the farm looked like at the start. It was like a ranch. Um, so like you can build all these oil refinery and all there, but you have to actually find oil to build like uh, the, all the oil things. You have to find oil to build them. So. Uh, these are all the mills and factories. Well, some of them anyway. There's like two sections to them. But these are like uh, the ones you build if you want different materials. Uh, this is the factories and stuff like that. The, more of the factories, but these are like better ones. Um, houses, just basic houses. I haven't built any apartments because I think they actually look really ugly. So uh, These are all like the sort of entertaining things. Uh, these are all, this is also a second section to the entertainment things. 
this is all the touristy stuff. Uh, see, I haven't actually built an airport. Maybe I'll show that. I'm going to build that this episode. Um, so these are all like the touristy stuff for all the tourists that uh, visit you. Uh, this is all like the stuff, like uh, sort of commercial stuff, uh, shops not there. Uh, this is the education uh, things. I don't know where the science lab is there. It isn't actually, a, it isn't like part of the education like thing. Uh, this is uh, just generic uh, sort of houses or houses, buildings that like help you earn money. Because the embassy gets you money from the different countries. The bank brings in money. Uh, the office brings in money. The custom office brings in money. The dry dock doesn't really bring in money. And the lighthouse is just basically there for show. But, you know. Uh, this is the all the military stuff. So I haven't built a prison yet. I've built a couple guard towers. But, uh, as you can see, I've built most of the things I can build. So, um... Now, now that I put this in my head, I need to go find it again. Hold on, where was it? There it is. Uh, let's build an airport. So, uh, the way the building works is just basically like any other generic uh, city builder. You basically just plonk it down where it can fit. And then uh, it builds it, or you can choose to quick build it for more money. And uh, that's basically just how it works. So, let's see. Where are we going to put this? Where are we going to put this? Where are we going to put this? I don't want it too close to the city because I've filmed that the planes will crash into the buildings. So let's put it here. That seems like a good place. So as you can see here, I can't quick build it because it's too far away. So what I'm going to need to do is go over here. Oh, uh, go down to road. Uh, click. Uh, where's the nearest road? Uh, here. And then I bring it right across to, say, here. Just to, just to start it off because I don't know where the entrance is. Oh, it's still, it's still too far away. Jesus, what do you want from me? Uh, I guess I'll build it a wee bit closer. Like that. I think that's alright. Please tell me you can... Yes! Right, so now I can quick build it. Uh, so, as you can see now, it's quick building. And it's built. Oh, and yeah, she's like a sort of radio host. She just like informs the people of what's happening. So, uh, now what we're going to do is we're going to demolish this stupid looking road. Well, that part. Oh, why is this? That's, this is a, like a glitch. I have no idea what this is. But, like, sometimes when you make your roads really, really long into, like, dirt, like, sort of big massive forest bit, they turn to, like, dirt roads. And this is what your roads look like if uh, you start off at the very beginning before the Cold War. This is what your roads look like before, like, the, the modern roads. So I have no, I think that's a glitch or something, cause I I have no idea. It just re looks really weird. Uh, so I might demolish this road till it gets to there. Oh wait, no, where? Oh no, I messed it up. Chase, this is just gonna be an episode of me demolishing roads. Right, stop. Right, I think that's it fixed. So uh, let's grab that from here again. But this time, let's just. Uh, oh, I need to build it round to the car park. Car pork? Jesus, I cannot just cannot talk today. Uh, let's build the two there. That seems pretty good. Yeah, that that's good enough. So, um, now that uh, this is open, uh, as you can see here, I can increase the pay, which I always do because I am a good leader. Um, I can charter. F the each building has like a sort of a special ability, so charter flights receive additional profits from tickets. That's alright. Diplomatic flights, all foreign relations are increased by 10, but the budget of the airport will be increased by 10%. So that's like uh, special abilities there. And as you can see here, um, if, you can't, if you can't find any people to work, you can hire foreign people to come, and that's why uh, you see like f seven foreign workers have arrived. I apologize if you can hear my sister shouting in the background, by the way. Uh, and you can hire, you can hire, uh, she's really driving me insane right now, I'm losing concentration. Oh my god, it's a plane. Jesus, that came in low. Um, you can hire managers, so you can, so you can, but all these managers have, like, different sort of skills, like, uh, increases the beauty in the vicinity by 10, effectiveness increase in job quality reduced by 10, uh, who hotels effectiveness increased by 10 that's like good for uh, the inns and all there that increases it 
uh, increases wealth for all, for 20% of the workers in the building. Uh, I'm not going to read through all of these because it's just going to bore you. Um, but uh, as you can see now, uh, people are starting to come into the airport. Planes are starting to fly in from here. Oh, that road's let's start again for God's sake. Um, so uh, that's Tropico Five. Um, I apologize for. Uh, the first like 15 minutes of this video just being me explaining well showing you what I've built but I just really had to do it so um hope you guys enjoyed leave a like if you did and uh, see you